What is? What's up? Gay? What's up, Taurus? What's up, bulls, baby? Did you miss me? Hey, boo, hey, if this is your first time to my channel, I'm Mocha. Also, if this is your first time to my channel, look out. I cuss, okay? I may cuss a little, may cuss a lot, just depending on what the hell these coins say. But, oh, I'm a cuss, okay? Cussing does not work for you right there now. Feel free to go find another beautiful reader here on YouTube that can further assist you without cussing. This is my shit, toys, okay? Also, thank you for the likes, the shares, the subscribes, the comments, the love, you guys, the donations, the readings, just all that. I truly appreciate it from the most humblest space ever, okay? You all, if you're a new subscriber, welcome to the family, y'all, right? We're really dysfunctional, all right? We, do, we don't fight and fuss, though. We leave that shit on other people's channel. But we do because we grow. We laugh. Sometimes we cry. We share. We love. We evolve. We like. We family over here. Positive teens, all right? Um, also, if you're returning family, <laughs> what's up, boo? How you doing? Y'all all right? Bulls. A little birdie told me, Taurus. Y'all is I his. Everybody not your friend, Taurus. They not. They 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 they, they not. They said. Little birdie told me that either some of y'all is tired of somebody's bullshit, or they not with your bullshit, not Taurus. Either way, I come to say today. Taurus, you got something to say. Hmm. Hmm. This will be for the summer rising Venus as well as the cross watchers for the sign of Taurus for the month of November. Taurus, y'all been having over a thousand views. I said, Taurus, you love a bitch. Ah, Taurus, I love you too, bulls. You know, we be knocking horns or whatnot, but can't nobody knock. What we got, we don't need to with the horns. Just say it. All right, so with that said, <laughs> Taurus, the song that I got for you guys made me smile, but it made me remember that I was 25 plus, and I was going to play the instrumental, but I ain't even finna, I ain't even finna juice it up for y'all. I ain't going to do that, okay? I ain't say this part. This, this message is going to resonate with some of y'all. It's not going to resonate with everybody. It's really personal. I got a special going on. Spend some money. All the tourists I know is cheap. How y'all make all the money and don't want to spend it? Put that shit in the car. I need to know. I need to know. Okay. But what I got for y'all was. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me go. Fast forward. Remember when I used to love them and leave them. Ow. That's what I used to do. Use and abuse them. Then I laid eyes on you. It was painful pleasure. That was my claim to fame. Took every measure, baby. Tasted teardrop stains, yeah. Okay, listen. Somebody, Taurus. Somebody was a motherfucker. Rick James bad around this bitch. Ha, psh, 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 slap. Psh, 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 psh. Somebody, Taurus, I'm feeling the sense of the game changer. And I may literally name this because I feel like for some of you all, there's been some type of game changer. This has to do with enlightenment. Some of you all are learning something. Some of you all uh, could also have to uh, travel when it comes to work opportunities that are causing you to step outside of your comfort zone, Taurus. Okay? Let's get into your intuitive messages for the month of November. I had to try and get y'all videos done. I may do Gemini tomorrow because I'm a little bit tired. I've been seeing videos and all that. 
Okay, I'm doing really personal readings, and y'all better get in on the little synchronicity single. It's only what was today? The eleven. It's gonna it's gonna end on uh tomorrow night at twelve a.m. So that's why I'm trying to get all these videos up done because I know y'all gonna run me ragged tomorrow. But it's twenty two dollars. Twenty two minutes, Taurus. Get two questions. Thirty three dollars for thirty three minutes, Taurus. I'm gonna run that damn session all night. Okay. $44. 44 minutes to us. Now, if y'all be like, oh, that mother, that's too much. Well, go look at my regular person. You better get in when you fit in. Y'all the only video I fit in. Because to y'all, y'all, well, Mocha, how you did that? <laughs> Not today. Okay? So let's get it. What you guys got was unexpected news. Facing fears, reminiscing, closure, plot twist, new love, endings, surprise endings, I'm sorry, apology, compromise, revelations, past life, regret, ancestral interference, collaboration, rich in resources, victim mentality, Breaking cycles, acceptance, apology, financial abundance, adaptability, family decisions. Okay? This is what I got for my choruses for the bulls. Y'all, please excuse my baby. He's trying to get to your mother again. Right? Overall energy around you guys is reading you guys got the eight of diamonds. Okay? Twice you're ready to open up. You now know what the hell you want. I definitely feel like some of you guys could be experiencing, or some of you guys, some of you guys' spirit is trying to move you into a new cycle. For some of you all, you've been getting a lot of intuitive hits about it. You just chose to stand there and just like, well, I guess maybe tomorrow. And then tomorrow never came to us. Okay? But for some of you all, you are bringing, hey, baby. No, don't do it. Don't come over here. Don't do it. Go ahead, get your stuff. You ready for the better? What? Can I make you a dentist appointment for a gap? It hurts. Okay, I got you. I'll do that. Sorry, Doris. My Gemini. Some of y'all may feel like a Gemini if it's just coming. But seeing out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah, they, they want to talk to us. Okay? For some of you all, this is some type of. um. Some, something being revealed for some of you all regarding air signs, your mind Aquarius, or revealing something too. Okay, for some of you all, this has to do with some of y'all just have to do with the sense of um, some of y'all is bringing there's some type of knowledge coming in a situation. Some of you guys are going to be learning something, but some of you all, it's not going to make you very happy, okay. For some of you all, something, a, a past event is returning towards, and I feel like it's one that's triggering for you, okay? I feel like it's one that is causing you, I, I, I keep hearing second chances, so for some of y'all, this could have to do with um, maybe you wanting a second chance, someone else wanting a second chance, but there's, a, there's, I feel like with this second chance, there's something that's connected to it, and I feel like it's coming to be an element of surprise, in the midst of a contract that has and I feel like this is a karmic contract with past life that has expired like okay I, I feel like for some of you all this is either you or another person being a catalyst to one's awakening to make it to make it a decision that is authentic and aligned with the authenticity of self unapologetically and for some of you all this has to do with you being truthful with your being truthful uh, being truthful with yourself some of y'all are learning or teaching someone some of y'all are teaching someone by taking leadership in a situation and knowing but there's a sense of the fear of the unknown and this aspect of complacency I tell you right now if you choose not to take the step the universe is gonna shake some shit up because y'all planet was that Uranus Uranus was really acting like an anus. Okay, your planet was really being an anus. 
and I believe it's in Taurus, and Uranus wants to know what are we going to do differently, Taurus? We, we understand, we, we, we love those ideas, we support that, we support those, things. we support what you want, but there's a sense of you needing to be clear with yourself. Some of you all may feel as if you're losing something, or there's this, there's this sense of feeling, uh, it's like some of you guys are afraid of leaving something or releasing something. First angel message. Teaching and learning. Archangel Zadkiel. Keep an open mind and learn new ideas and then teach them to others. Okay, so some of you guys could also be in school as well or hear positive news regarding some type of school. Some of you all, this also has to do with, um, some of y'all could be taking some type of like terms or studying for like midterms. Others of you could also be taking on some type of trade, okay, or wanting to go to some type of trade school. Uh, for some of you all, um, this actually, some of y'all are spiritual teachers. Oh, as above, so below. Spirit is actually, some of y'all are being used as vessels to bring illumination. Some of y'all, this is regarding the education system. Some of y'all, this could even be regarding like politi politics. Some of y'all, I'm hearing artifacts. Others of you, this has to do with unlocking the art of manifestation. Some of you all are learning things about your ancestry during this time. Things are being illuminated. If there was any blockages, yeah, this is also about you allowing yourself to really shine without worrying about any type of backlash. And for some of you all, this comes with the sacrifice of something. And I feel like you're being called to take the love and the lesson, not the hurt. You want to get something different? You got to be willing to do something different, of course, okay? Some of you all, this also has to be, some of y'all are, are going through some massive downloads during this time, and I feel like there's a need for you to not sit on that shit. Don't sit and wait. Hold on. Let me think about it. No, Taurus. Don't think about it. Just do it. You're being called to go say it. Do it. The divine is lining things up. It's like once you surrender this situation comes, it's like, fall, I feel like I'm hearing falls in your lap, falls in your lap. And some of you all, some of y'all intuitively know that you have to, um, you have to release a situation. I feel like things are being illuminated through your dream space in the month of November as well. Some of y'all could be connected with the father or uncle. Or, um, this could also be somebody on the other side. This person is guiding you, showing you the way. For some of y'all, that way is right into the damn forms of Sagittarian person who just gonna come out of nowhere, just falling in your lap. Bloop! There you go. I know it. Next message you guys got is You Are Safe, Archangel Michael. I'm protecting you against lower energies and guarding you, your loved ones, and home. Okay, so some of you all may feel as if some of y'all. So, okay, I'm hearing it. So some of y'all this may have to do with the cutting away of something, a particular person or a thing or a place. Some of y'all this is re requiring you to start completely over and knowing that you are safe to do so because some of you all are literally in a situation where you feel that you have to be defensive. Some of y'all, somebody could even be making threats against your home. This could be an outside person who you love. Somebody's very obsessive in your energy toy. Somebody needs to know what you're doing. Who you talk to? What you doing? What you got? Mm. Uh, 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 uh. You and I feel like some of y'all. This person, they mirror your own insecurities towards. Let's go. I told you, Virgo. Welcome to Scorpio season, baby. <laughs> this person, it's like it has to do with. The aspect of the Plutonic energy from Scorpio, the darkness, afterlife, past life, timeline shifts, Mars energy, passions, movement, sacral energy, knowing what to damn do, trusting your inner self, trusting what you receive and what you're being guided to do. Then that crown chakra reason. Some of y'all may be even having some type of tingling within the crown chakra. The spirit is saying, move, Taurus, move. Some of you all, this also has to do with speaking up for yourself, 
not in a defensive way of feeling as if you have to defend yourself. The spirit is saying you are protected. Some of you all, yeah, some of y'all feel as if, some of y'all, I feel that you're going to be fine. But some of y'all, um, I may have to defend yourself in a family situation. Speak up. Some of y'all are, hmm, towards maybe you going to come across this whole fucking shake up. Somebody, some of y'all could have been wrong when it came to something about some money. Or you could be Taurus. Now listen, how the cookie crumble. This ain't the time to be fucking over nobody now. Not Scorpio season. Not retrograde Scorpios. Don't do it. And if you fear that something's not going to go in your favor if you speak up for yourself, or if you plotting and planning and waiting until somebody gets some shit that belongs to you and then you're going to get your spirit of saying really it's safe for you to drop the defense and speak your truth and move forward. So this was a part of your journey when it comes to the sense of self-mastery. You're naturally a dualistic sign. You know how to You've mastered the aspect of duality being with someone. Some of y'all have done it in a very unhealthy way, but you know how to cope you know how to work around the energy of another person, but now you guys are being forced to be your own damn best friend. And for some of you all, the sense of the sense of us it, it's like it's a time to recreate toys. Some of y'all also need to have a conversation with the father figure. Some of you are also maybe receiving some type of or give towards some of y'all can be finding out about somebody's kids, some of y'all can be finding out that either you have a child or your, your spouse has a child or is pregnant by someone else's spouse. Some crazy shit going on in the month of November. She's being illuminated. This is weird. Not weird, this was normal. Shit. Listen, y'all got the tea. I felt it before I even started doing y'all shit as well. See, what messages do you have for Taurus? Some of y'all are cutting off the situation for your own self growth and doing so it's going to bring blessings to you. So just if you were having to depend on another person for finances, I also see some type of financial opportunity coming about. There's good news when it comes to finances. You are protected. You just got to surrender to, to the ask, surrender uh, to that vibration of worry. And control and manipulation for some of y'all. Yeah, some of you all are in your damn head about um releasing a situation, possibly involved or something being. Some of y'all just have I, I can't I, I heard exposed. Some of y'all are in your head. Some of y'all also could be being blackmailed. I heard blackmail. This can involve a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. For some of you all, yeah, some of you guys are very indecisive about making a damn about making one day. One damn decision possibly between two things, two places, okay? But I feel like you stressed out in this space of sitting still. But some of you all, mm -hmm. some of you guys could feel the need to defend yourself or defend your home from possibly a fire sign, every still Sagittarius, or maybe something is being illuminated around it. Somebody is coming in and I feel like it's making someone else feel the need to de to be defensive okay i feel like for some of you all this yeah somebody was resisting making a damn decision but another person is ending a damn cycle it is all fire sign air sign some of you guys are having to choose possibly between a um aries leo sagittarius or a capricorn towards virgo some of y'all just have to do with some type of karma being here somebody was born night Laying they uh bountiful seeds. There's also a truth coming out around um regarding a child. Some of y'all could also be dealing with paternity, child support court. I do feel the justice is going to go in your favor for for most of you. For some of y'all, it's not. But I feel like some of you all, huh? Some of you all is resisting somebody. It's like you're afraid of someone finding out that you went back to like a child's mother. 
that you want to go back to a child mother who could be a cancer Pisces Scorpio. This person could also be pregnant. Mm. And some of you guys was wanting to start something new. Some of y'all just have to do with some type of past energy. Somebody, Taurus, if somebody kept you on the outskirts or kept you in the sense of unknowing, some of you guys, some of y'all could have paid some type of private investigator or somebody paid some type of private investigator, Taurus. Somebody is manipulating somebody. Somebody, oh shit. For some of y'all mentally and in your heart space, you're done with the situation. But some of y'all is playing poker face in a situation with someone who you share assets with. Somebody's waiting on a big check. Somebody could have told you they was going to give you something or invest in your business. I do feel that some of y'all, this is, yeah, there is going to be help coming in from another earth sign, Capricorn to Virgo, okay? For some of you all, this is about you finally speaking up or someone speaking up. Some of y'all going to find out that somebody has been given to two different family situations. This could be someone who has more than one child's mother or child's father. But somebody somebody is resisting a connection because they would have to change. They would have to grow. And this is a beautiful connection here, Doreen. Love and finances, stability, family, nurturing. Openness. This is like being in love with your best friend. But I feel like some of you all, in order to make this move and have this sense of newness for some of you all, you're going to have to move away from possibly a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Some of you all, there's a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. There's some type of third party shit coming out about this person. This could be definitely somebody from your past. Somebody could have walked away because they didn't want to be part of a damn third party. I feel like this is a past life person as well. And for some of you all, you could have tried to resist this person, but there's somebody trying to somebody trying to spark a situation back up. Because some of y'all, you you or another person wants to give this sense of stability, but there's this there's this fear of will you be solid because I can't fight this connection. Will you be willing to slowly rebuild on something solid? Or will you continue to resist this because of what happened in the past? Some of you guys. Hmm. Some of you all are given to a situation because you feel entitled to give to the situation, even though your head and your heart is elsewhere, possibly with the damn water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, another earth sign. Some of you all, there. this could also be your spouse feeling like this towards you. Somebody's wanting to reconnect with the water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, another air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But they know that they have to walk away from something and they're really tired of carrying all the weight. Somebody feel like somebody is emotionally immature. You guys, some of you guys are, some of you guys, somebody is extending an offer to like make amends in a situation here. For some of you all, somebody is making a manipulative offer. I feel like whoever's making this offer is trying to block. Somebody want to renew a situation towards because they know that you're emotionally disconnected. Somebody's trying to block you from moving forward. I do feel that you are protected. I feel like you're going to find out that this person was doing this in the past. And some of you all, you're afraid of. Yeah, some of y'all. Some of y'all, there's a sense of like some type of reconciliation happening. After freeing yourself, removing yourself from a situation, possibly with a fire sign. Some of you guys are wanting to offer somebody commitment. You've been keeping this to yourself. Some of y'all are nervous as hell. For others of you, some of y'all could be some of y'all could be scared of someone because it's like they see right through you. Towards some of you guys could be also exposing. There's a sense of exposure. 
possibly around the Gemini, Scorpio. Someone could have also been sending you the sense of a spirit of confusion. I'm hearing magicians revealed. Trisha dreams to us. For some of you all, there is a karmic partner that is dreaming of your next move. Some of y'all got somebody that's extremely... Some of y'all, somebody is keeping their peace. They're giving very little to a situation. Because some of y'all, somebody is going to sneak the fuck out. And go transform their life. They, somebody focus on what they want, Taurus. They want what they want. What they want. I definitely see movement forward. So if you're dealing with a um, water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, I definitely feel like this is someone from your past. You or this other person could have had multiple options. Somebody wanted to explore their options just to get out there to find out that their options wasn't shit. So if you just uh, if you're going through some type of breakup, or we'll be going through some, some of y'all will be going through, through some type of breakup during the Scorpio season. For some of y'all, this person will be back by Sagittarius season, mid December. Okay. Some of y'all, this could definitely be someone who uses children to manipulate you. Someone plays on this sense of, like, abandonment issues. Some of y'all, this could also have to do with someone manipulating another person by, like, dangling love in their damn face. But you have the option of an offer coming in from someone who you have a deep connection with. So some of y'all could be dealing with two water signs. Somebody who has this in their chart. But I definitely feel like someone wants to offer an apology for their hoish behavior in the past. For some of you all, I'm hearing final decision, final decision. So some of y'all are giving somebody just one last, one last try. For some of you all, you, you're releasing yourself from a situation. And in doing so, you're going to see this massive transformation. Keep hearing, go it alone, go it alone, Taurus. For others of you, you could actually... um. Some of y'all could be, I'm, I'm, I'm here sealing the deal. So some of you guys, this could have to do with some type of license. And some of y'all could be receiving some type of license in any mail unexpected. Some of you all, there's an offer towards. Some of y'all could be actually getting an offer um, from something that you have a trade for. It's gonna, some of y'all, something regarding a boat. For some of you all, this also has to do with some type of construction. Or something that you do with your hands. For others of you, this is an opportunity to um, some type of mentoring. Some of you all also could be trying to go to school for law or choosing to go to school for law. Family counseling. Some of y'all are still needing to forgive your damn daddy tour. That's a blockage. Heal. If you're dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, some of y'all you don't trust this person. Y'all don't trust each other. And I feel like for some of you, yeah, some of y'all, I keep hearing blackmail. Somebody is blackmailing somebody to me. Somebody is also emotionally manipulative, I hear. Some of you all are dealing with an air sign. This person knows they, what they're keeping to themselves is that. This person, I feel, there's a lot of fucking towards here. Somebody is feeling guilty. Or somebody is paranoid about some type of third party coming out of someone. Somebody is feeling paranoid about making a decision regarding a third party, which way they're going to go. And it's crazy because some of y'all dealing with an air sign towards this person. I feel like this person always has an eye on you. Some of y'all could also be, some of y'all, this could be your energy. All them swords up there, but that motherfucker sitting on one to stab you with later. They're waiting for the perfect time towards And some of you all, you feel it, but you, I'm hearing the woe is thou, woe is me. Some of you all feel as if you're in some type of competition or battle with your partner. Because both of y'all are in the same damn energy, wanting this fulfillment, you want to be happy. You want peace, you want harmony, you want stability. Some of y'all focus on your damn money, you ain't got time for nobody's fucking feelings. And they're feeling neglected. 
and somebody has an opportunity for new love. Yet they have the same decision to make that you had to make. So now again, divine independence. If you don't make the decision, Taurus, it's going to be made for you in the month of November. If you're dealing with the earth sign, Capricorn Taurus, what about Somebody is coming into your life to assist you with balancing, balancing things out. Someone wants to bring you an apology. Someone does not want to lose their shot. Some of y'all could be dealing with another Taurus, okay? Some of you all, you're freeing yourself from this situation and it's going to bring you balance as well as a growth and in, in damn income, okay? Some of you guys feel as if you are overgiven to a situation or someone feels as if they're overgiven to a situation with you. They feel as if you won't open up and compromise. Uh, someone feels as if you give very little. Someone also sees you as being emotionally immature and somebody feels as if they were tricked towards, okay? Someone feels as if they've been fighting for nothing. They've been supportive. They've been waiting for the offer that they fucking deserve for you to give. Some of you guys, this could definitely be the mother of your children. I got the. Some of y'all, this could also be someone who you're married to, someone who you um, share a business with as well. This could also be some type of collaboration with some type of business deal, possibly with the mother of your children. Bringing what you have. It's going to also be something, because for some of y'all, this has to do with an offer, but both parties bringing what they have to build something solid. Moving from chaotic waters to calm, smooth, and sailing waters. I'm off, some of y'all. Towards watch your money. Somebody is plotting on somebody's money. They already got a plan. They just waiting on that date. And that date, somebody ain't gonna come home to that money, okay? Or somebody gonna come at that motherfucker out and tell everybody's fucking business and fuck all your shit up. There is, I keep hearing plot twist to us, okay? Get ready so yes, ain't got to stay ready. Someone feels that they were caught in the middle of weed in the midst of some bullshit. Somebody feels that they was finessed and finagled. And somebody's releasing themselves out of this damn web of emotions. Continuously feeling as if they have to rebuild, 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 and someone feels as if this is about adaptability to us. We're gonna be forced on that path, okay? Money looks good though. You definitely have to release uh, release some type of karmic partner here. Y'all is just really getting down. My kids for being with his back, he left out more, he came back. We're dealing with a fire sign, every single Sagittarius. Mm -hmm. Hold on. I feel like if you're dealing with a fire sign and things was on a standstill, someone definitely wants to move things forward. Someone and got someone's getting out their damn head. Somebody's making a damn decision. Some of you guys are some of y'all, either you or this damn fire sign, somebody trying to manipulate the other person. Somebody wants another person to wait and sit still or to be patient with them. Wait for them to make a decision and somebody got other plans. Listen, I got every damn thing I need. Why do I got to wait on you? I made the decision to keep things sitting still until you make a fucking decision. Because... I, you know, this fire sign says I'm in tune with my shadows. Some of y'all, this person is not making a decision. Or this this person is coming in to clear up some type of confusion about why things didn't move forward. Somebody, somebody felt as if they were being manipulated. Or somebody saw through a manipulator. Definitely got a new opportunity coming. Possibly with Sagittarius and Leo. Water sign. Cancer Pisces Scorpio. You got new love and opportunity and new love and newness. Some of y'all been patiently waiting for this to come back around and it's here. Well, like by Sagittarius season, some of y'all is gonna have all new everything. Some of y'all moving to new home with new love. True love. Some of y'all got a baby in there damn early to find out somebody. Some of y'all knock somebody up. Right? Well, Spirit, what's your advice for Taurus? Hmm. Get, let that shit go, Taurus. Let it go. 
Some of y'all are relieving your burdens of a fire sign. So I only see in love in a situation and an opportunity to grow. Someone's coming to bring closure. Some of y'all are releasing a stressful situation that she had a hard time doing in a past like a soul contract here is over to her. The map, what the fuck, I said, self fucking mastery. Somebody's releasing the damn burden. Let it go. Some of y'all are dealing with a controlling spouse. You're overexerted by them. I'm, I'm fucking tired of you. Get the fuck. Some of y'all just have to do with the mother figure, okay? But mastering your emotions. Mastering that aspect of the self. Trusting yourself. Trusting what you feel. Independence. When the student, what, what, what they say, when the when the student is ready, the teacher shall appear. Some of y'all manifest this. But in order to gain, you gotta be willing to let that shit that don't serve, let, let that shit that is blocking that space of harmony, blocking shit from coming into fruition for you, because persons, some of y'all dealing with a very selfish fucking person. And I feel like for some of you all, you feel that like somebody's always riding your fucking back, you're tired, you want peace. You the creator. You are the creator of your damn dream. You the you the you the driver of that damn boat, Taurus. What you gonna do? Okay. Do see you guys becoming or being in the space of self mastery, being true to yourself. All right. So y'all, that was a little juicy. If you need a personal reading, that information will be found in the description. I will see you guys here for the mid month of November. And I love you all a long time. Peace, love, and light, babies. Bye, y'all.